there can be only one or in this case two but it's um, one channel um, naturally this is my conclusion to the top ten channels on YouTube that were um, most impactful since I've been on and uh, the one thing that I can say about this here is that when I started doing this top 10 which was over a year ago there's been a number of, of changes in the countdown um, people have gone up um, the scale people have gone down the scale people have exited the scale and people have entered people have re-entered um, but the one thing that has stayed constant throughout is number one there's been no deviation from number one um, when I first started it uh, they were at number one and as you hear me now they're number one and with that um, for me the most impactful channel that, I could, that I've come across has been that of Comic Culture Warrior now chances are if you're not subscribed to them there's a strong likelihood that you've still heard of them um, these gentlemen are probably the hardest for me to describe um, you have um, Elliot Serrano who, uh, who I would characterize as being sort of the um, pragmatic one I guess um, and you have Jose Melendez who if nothing else if nothing else other than perception uh, uh, he would definitely be the one that most would see as the one that kinda goes for um, the jugular that said um, they've taken their share of knocks you know people don't um, um, fancy what they consider to be um, negative stuff that comes from their channel and my perspective on that has always been they basically speak their truth you know if they like something they like it hard and if they hate something they hate it hard and I could probably have used a better analogy than that but you get my point um, they're not the channel you listen to if you're a fan of someone and you end up hearing something that you don't like by someone that you're a fan of because chances are in that case you're going to be put off by what it is they have to say um, myself um, you know it, it hasn't all been peaches and cream you know uh, um, there's been discussions about um, for the lack of uh, a better description um, Old Man Logan um, it's quite clear abundantly clear that that these gentlemen were not a fan um, of that comic series and I was a big fan of that comic series but um, um, we both we all you know basically made our points in which case at the end of the day uh, in, in an unspoken manner we pretty much you know put it up to agreeing to disagree and I think that's what's lost on a lot of people these days who take so many things so personally you know and uh, um, I don't begrudge them hardly anything uh, um, a lot of what they like I don't like a lot of what I like 
they don't like and I don't have a problem with it what I do like is that they're totally candid with what it is they have to say they don't um, um, sugarcoat anything um, they don't placate anybody and they don't patronize anybody and they don't care to be patronized and uh, I can respect all of those things um, um, you know, uh, um, Elliot, who also has geek to me, uh, uh, tends to always um, um, kind of, I don't know how you would say it, uh, 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 he kind of feels things out before um, he says something definitive, but when you finally get there, you know, he's just as passionate about what he feels um, um, as Jose is. And um, I know Elliot has taken some knocks for for um, sort of of uh, being in the shadow, if you will, of Jose. And if anything has proven that that's not the case, all you have to do is check out the video for what I call um, the bet. And anybody that's seen the bet, that's a video that is legendary. Um, 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 that pits um, um, Jose's certainty against uh, uh, um, Elliot's pragmatism as it relates to Tony Daniels Batman and how well it will or won't do. Man, that is a glorious, that is a glorious video. But aside from that, you know, these two guys, um, where other guys basically just um, go around agreeing with each other, you know, these guys will, will occasionally um, rib each other and whatnot and you can appreciate that because um, at the end of the day you know they give no quarter and they take no quarter you know as the you know some of the old movie serial um, folks used to say and uh, uh, um, and just speaking for myself you know comic culture warrior were the second channel to subscribe to me and um, I subscribed um, how do I say that and I subscribed when I subscribed to them um, they were the second channel that I subscribed to uh, somewhere along, somewhere along, there might have had an annotation. I think I misworded something along the line, uh, along that first part there. But anyway, um, um, when the road has been, as the road has been rocky, as the road has been smooth, I pretty much wouldn't change anything about it. And uh, you know, big time props to both Elliot and Jose. Um, I know it's been a little while since um, their last video. And uh, um, hopefully there'll be another one coming up soon. Um, but if not, um, regardless, um, these two guys, uh, the YouTube pop culture world would be less enriched um, 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 were they not to be on it. So pretty much right there, concludes my top 10 list for um, channels that I felt were the uh, most impactful um, to me at least you know in my opinion so until next time this is PM Knight saying night out